Hey everybody, Jay Crash here with a little Netflix find for you. This film's from 2012 called Starlet. And I hadn't heard anything about this film, and I wouldn't have heard anything about it had I not been sifting through the infinite amount of shit on Netflix streaming. And if you're a film fan, uh, you know what I'm talking about. Uh, I end up turning off so many of these little indie B-flicks. Uh, I love to give them a shot. And usually if I'm not hooked within about 15 or 20 minutes, I kill it. Or if I can see that it's just a, an average film, I shut it off. This film, though, captivated me and held me to the very end. And I thought it was a very good little film. And probably the biggest reason this film didn't get a lot of attention is because it's an NR rating. And when you hear about the storyline and the context of the film it might seem a surprise and it is it's nr due to some graphic sexual content and some sexual themes that run through this film and it's it's nothing that's uh super creepy or complex nothing that doesn't happen every day and i don't want to get too far into depth with this film but suffice it to say don't let that stray you from seeing this film. The filmmaker here made some really bold choices. He sacrificed a rating and attention to present an overall character relationship study. And the film, it's a real special little film. It centers around the relationship between this young aspiring actress who's probably in her uh, early 20s, late teens, and an elderly lady who strike up this friendship because the younger girl's out shopping at this lady's yard sale and she finds this vase and she buys the vase and it has a bunch of money in it. And so there's this kind of this moral dilemma that comes up and they end up striking up this relationship. And it's just a very well done film. It builds towards a climax that I thought was very effective and, and very open. This is a courageous film. I commend the filmmaker for making a film that he envisioned. And the way he tied it in together, it touches on some exploitation that goes on in certain industries uh, and kind of ties that in, allowing for more depth of the lead character. And it was a really good performance by the lead character, Dree Hemingway. Uh, check out Starlet. I think it's a good film, solid film. You're going to want to see it. Take care, everybody. It's Jay Crash. Pretty pictures in a magazine Everybody is so make-believe